We are welcome to our first video on the concept of utility. And in today's video, we are going to look at how to calculate marginal utility. So the question says that the table below shows the different levels of satisfaction that the consumer will derive from the consumption of oranges in a day. So the number of oranges have been given as 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. And the total utility has been given. We need to calculate the marginal utility. The first question says that we should calculate the marginal utility of this consumer. And the last one, that we should determine the consumer's uh, maximum point of satisfaction and give reasons. To calculate the marginal utility, we know that marginal utility is equal to change in total utility over change in consumption. That is change in the units consumed. So that is how we are going to calculate the marginal utility. And we know that utility is the satisfaction derived from consuming a given unit of a particular good. And this utility is measured in utils and also marginal utility measured in utils. So we are going to look for, since the total utility is given, we are going to look for marginal utility. And we know that marginal utility is equal to change in total utility of a change in consumption. Since uh, no unit was consumed and there was no total utility, so we can put this one zero. So for the first one, a marginal utility will take the first uh, total utility, which is equal to 15. We are going to look for the extra utility. That, that is the extra satisfaction derived from consuming the second unit or the second orange. So we are going to have, uh, we are going to have 25 minus 15 to be equal to 10. So that is our marginal utility after consuming the second orange. So we do not need to divide by the number of the number of uh, units consumed since it increases by one. So the change in consumption is one. So dividing by one will still give the same answer. So we can just go through by taking it directly. So for the third unit, we are going to look for the extra utility after consuming the third unit, which we are going to have 30 minus 25, which gives us 5. That's a 5 utils. And the fourth, and the fourth orange, so we need to look for the difference. So we are going to have 30 minus 30 which gives us zero and the last uh, orange that is the fit orange after consuming the fit orange we are going to have 25 minus 30 which gives us minus 5 the first question says says that we should calculate the marginal utility of this consumer so this is the uh, different uh, marginal utilities that we have calculated for the different for the different uh, oranges consumed. And the last one said that we should determine the consumer's maximum point of satisfaction and reasons. So the consumer's uh, maximum point of satisfaction is at the food un uh, orange. After consuming the food orange, so he will derive his uh, maximum satisfaction. So to determine this, we know that utility is maximized where marginal utility is zero. So a point where the consumer will derive maximum satisfaction is at the fourth unit. And at this point, marginal utility is zero. So it, it is at this point that the consumer will derive its maximum satisfaction. And this point is also called satiety. So, and it will be at the fourth unit with the total utility of 30.